ASCII art is the super old art form of taking a pre-existing image and converting it into text symbols. And of course, this kind of thing would take forever to do by hand, so there are programs and websites that automate this whole process. But then I thought to myself, wait a minute, Blender has a super capable shader node editor that will let us do all this procedurally, meaning that we can control stuff like the ASCII resolution, the types of symbols we're using, and we can also use harder outputs like video and procedural noises. And it turns out that making something like this isn't impossibly hard, so I ended up making it myself, but I am getting ahead of myself here. So the algorithm from getting to here to here is actually just a matter of four steps. And we start off by taking our image and making it a bit more discreet, meaning we just take our input and turn it into a bunch of single colored cells. The way you'd normally do this is by taking your image input with its texture coordinates and just throwing a Voronoi texture in between with the randomness set to zero. Next, we're going to convert this into a grayscale texture, which you can do by adding in an RGB to black and white node. This way, we've taken our original image and converted it into a grid of single value cells, which can be ranked according to brightness and then assigned ASCII symbols according to this ranking. So all the cells with value 1 will be assigned the first image in our sequence, the cells with value 2 the second image, and so on. And with this algorithm, we actually maintain a bunch of control over stuff like the resolution in the discrete step, how many values we want to assign in the first place, and which ASCII symbols we want to appear in our sequence. So long story short, start with an image, turn this into cells, make it black and white, assign values according to brightness, and populate in our ASCII symbols, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So all this algorithm stuff is pretty cool, but at the end of the day, how do I take my movie clips and convert them into ASCII art without spending all day messing with node networks? And that's an excellent question, because I've again made this available for download for free on Gumroad. And if you're in the position where you'd like to donate or have the means to do so, please do, but otherwise, again, this is available for free. And once you download it, you'll see that there's a folder with the ASCII converter blend and a sprite folder, which is where the ASCII symbols are drawn from. By the way, I forgot to mention, keep this blend file in the sprite folder together. Do not separate them. Keep them in the same directory. And as for using this, it's really as easy as opening up the blend file, importing in whatever media it is that you want to convert, and toggling over to rendered mode. But, and this is a big but, there are additional controls. Like a resolution slider, an aspect ratio slider, which is useful if you want to have square pixels, a margin slider, which you can pretty much ignore, and a symbol slider, which controls how many ASCII symbols the algorithm will use. And remember, these are drawn from the sprites folder, which means we can add in more symbols or even use random images and Instead. But yeah, that pretty much wraps it all up. That's all I have for you.